What's up, everybody? It's Saturday. It's uh, pretty cold today. I think we're about around uh, 15 right now. It's gonna be. We're gonna get to a heat wave today. So it's gonna be 24 to 26. It's time to break out the thong. That's right. Yes, I have one of my patented shirts that says, "I'm a Puerto Rican dad, like an old dad, much but much cooler." That's what this says. So, yeah, I have a different shirt on all the time. I'm weird like that. Um. But I'm, I was reading through my stuff. See, I don't think people understand. I do read a lot of the comments on my page, on my my group, on my timeline, um, on Twitter, on Instagram, um, geez, uh, Pinterest, uh, LinkedIn. I read all the comments. I read everybody's info. I, I'm not the info. I mean, what they put. I do look at your info too. And yes, I do look at your pictures. So, I kind of feel like I know some of you. Um, I'm going to tell you something. I just read some comments this morning that kind of blew my mind. Somebody goes, well, I've been taking vitamin D for so long it has not helped me one bit. Look, look, look. So you're totally missing the whole point. I, I said it yesterday and I'm hoping that they listen to my videos and what I'm trying to say as well as much as I learned from them. Vitamin D, vitamin B, and, and vitamin A and, and E and all those, it doesn't, it's not going to cure MS. Nothing can just cure MS. It's a combination of things that made MS, henceforth, it's going to take a combination of things to make you better. Vitamin D and vitamin B and vitamin A and all, and and and, 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 and all this stuff, greens and, and food, it doesn't cure. It helps your body fight the toxins that are in your that, that are destroying your body. See, MS, your body's confused. That's why it's attacking itself. It thinks that there's something foreign there. Now there is something foreign. It's called MS. But we don't know what MS does or where MS is. Now, there's a big thing in the medical community. Some people say it's a virus. Some people think it's 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 a disease. Some people think it's um, an AI disease. You decide. Well, whatever. The point of the matter, what I've been trying to get to, I can care less about what they figure out. Okay, look, I'm going to do this regardless. Regardless of what they figure out, I'm going to help my body the best way I can. That's the whole point of finding the pieces to your puzzle. That's why I wrote my books, is to help you figure out what works for you. Now, that's why no two people are the same. So it's not going to work the same for everyone. So it's like losing weight. Um, some people can get onto the, the, the swing diet and lose 500 pounds in like two minutes. Some people can, uh, well, I drink bath water and I lost all this weight. I, uh, I, uh, I lick toads. I like to eat my toenails. I don't know, whatever, whatever your thing. I ain't mean, I'm just saying. I like to, to eat the yellow snow. That might be your thing. Um, I know he didn't, he didn't say that, did he? Yes, I did. Um, just remember, vitamin D, these vitamins, everything they say, you're going to see the pluses and the minuses to it. Did I lose my thing? I sure did. So I give her a tremble my neck around, act like I'm something I'm not. Anyway, um, vitamin D and all these vitamins, you're going to get people saying how bad they are for you and what they won't do. Okay. Now, what they're trying to do is they're trying to obscure what's going on to make you dependent on what they say is more uh, on their medicines. Now, look, I'm not saying Tecfidera. I'm not saying Copaxin. I'm not saying uh, whatever, all those stuff. I haven't been taking the, the other MS drugs are not well. But I want people to stop for a second and look at the obscurity. The obscure... Anything that helps your body, natural stuff that helps your body, but they don't they don't obscure their medicines, which has a whole bunch of side effects. Funny, Tecfidera is not going to cure MS either. Neither is Copaxin. It's not going to cure. It's going to help your body patch up where it needs to be patched so your body can do its job. That's all it does. So what does vitamin D do? Same thing. Now, it's not a replacement for Tecfidera. See, Tecfidera has a specific job to do. 
so does vitamin D, so does vitamin A, so does vitamin B. A specific job. Now you have a specific job. You have to make sure your body has all the stuff needed to fight off negative effects. And when you get sick, you eat chicken soup. Now why do people eat chicken noodle soup? It's been proven the ingredients they put in chicken noodle soup, like uh, the the celery, the carrots, all this, all that batch stuff is a bunch of vitamin A, vitamin B, niacins, um, different. Uh, I forgot the word, but different things you need for your body to get better. It, it boosts the the white blood cells in your body to make to fight off the the sickness, the flu, the the, the foreign virus. Well, that's the same situation when it comes to vitamins that you take so don't let the obscurity of others determine what you're doing stop stop letting people blind you open your eyes for a second think for a second for yourself stop listening to what they even what I say if I don't make sense to you tell me to go somewhere um, but all I'm trying to do is show you guys look Don't narrow your vision because you heard or you read one article that said, no, it doesn't work. Or maybe because you did something. It's helping you in a way that you can't see. There's a blog I wrote, and there's a chapter in my book I wrote. It it was when you you dig inches, you take inches. And the more inches you see and you win, the more wins you have, all of a sudden you notice you're five miles from where you started. Same thing with vitamin D and these vitamins. You take them, 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 them, and you religiously take them. They're doing something in your body that you're not looking for because you're looking for that ultimate goal. You're not looking for the little, the the scratches you're getting. You're not looking for the little inches you're making. So look at that as far as your diet, as far as everything. Uh, Now, what I mean by that also is don't go and weigh yourself for five, five seconds and I've lost a half pound. That doesn't mean nothing. You can have, I, I can gain 20 pounds by smelling donuts, you know, or fried chicken. Ooh, don't get me on that. Um, but that's what I'm saying. Is you look for what you're, now, my my trainer, Justin, says one thing. He's right. When you look in the mirror, do you see the tone? Do you see the muscles? Do you feel better? I say, yes, I do. He goes, then you're doing it. And you're doing what you need to. You might not be rock solid right off the bat or you know cut up and all that stuff but you'll get there you gotta work it has to work you know I feel the muscles coming in I, I, I can see it I'm not gonna show you guys though that's only for me my mirror and my kitty because my kitty's the only one in the bathroom with me sad sad I'm more sad him being anyway um Please, people, don't let something you don't understand at first deter you. Don't let your eyes get obscured by this junk. Keep doing it. Keep on the path. Keep on the path. Slow as they would in the race. As long as you stay on the course, you're going to finish. All right? So do that. Um, RamonHeronGarcia.com. It's my blog where you get my books. I, I hope you guys get better. I hope you guys figure it out. Really do. I'll talk to you guys Monday.